Let's do it! Welcome back! Time to fuck the ship. Yeah. Right in the rudder. Uh, uh, Damn it now. Uh, fuck. Oh, my fucking pussy. Oh, shit. I like... Uh, 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 <laughs> oh, oh. Auto... Oh. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Autoerotic asphyxiation. T tell me about it. That's my favorite kink. Kink? Yeah. Kink? yeah. Wasn't there like a, something called kinky boots or something? Wasn't it a thing? I don't That's a play. Home. Is it? Well, man. Well, man. The kink in these boots. Kink in these chain or is it a kink in my hair or something? That was a show. Yeah. It's very I have no ethical. idea what you guys are talking about. David, we're talking about the kink in this hair. <laughs> Come on, man. I'm sorry, I guess I'm not just not with the times. God, you fucking piece of shit. I'm gonna fuck. Whoa, what? It scrolled up, you loser. I know, what the fuck? My, it's like my jump is fucked. I told you, the one button. Remember? Jump is two. Yeah. Ow. <laughs> I poked David in the face by mistake. Uh, Remember? I gotta do four. In season yeah. one, when that was a thing. What? It's all over. <laughs> it's all over? Welcome back to the first episode of Turbo. <laughs> hey, that's my joke. You fucking sack of it's shit. It's such a season one joke. <laughs> it's so old. Uh, how do we <laughs> how do we start? We just did. Oh my god. <laughs> We've referenced that specific <laughs> moment so many times. It's a beautiful little moment cuz it was actually little was known genuine. fact, it was genuine. Like that. Oh. Just like that. God. Like that was literally Fucking the very first time any damn like damn it. You pushed record. That's yeah. true. No practice. We go in dry. I try that once. I always do. And then I wound up <laughs> in Mexico. <laughs> Mexico. Oh, I get it, because you had too many dry tequilas. <laughs> I don't drink. Who does? I don't know. People. Not, not us. Alcoholics. I mean, I had some rum. People who drink ago. social. I think you're just like on the bus here. Well, yeah. <laughs> it's like, Jesus Christ. It's like That's what airport. I mean, but not too long ago. Yeah, you can get What drinks. the fuck even? Nice. It may be because I hit B. I don't know what I would have done with it. I, I was going to say, it, but... why would your controller all of a sudden <laughs> impede me? Haven't you heard? David is the word. Dave. I want like, that to be a thing now. I want to hear like somebody completely remix the song. <laughs> Just with Dave? With Dave. Dave. Even though nobody calls you Dave. You know one of my favorite things to Some do people call me Dave. Is is to uh, search someone's name, like any name, and then put uh, happy birthday after it on YouTube. Yeah. Because people always make these personalized videos for people. And so it's like to send a personalized video oh. for someone else to someone is kind of hilarious. That's funny. And so it's pretty great when it's like, happy no. birthday, David. It's like for some other fucking David. And it's like this weird inside joke with their friends. And then you're just like, what the fuck? <laughs> I like it's making my own personalized now. birthday greetings. That's true. You're very good at birthday greetings. My fucking like jumps through a window, exploding sun shit. Like, <laughs> oh. My favorite one was... Ripping an uh, awesome electric guitar solo. <laughs> that was good. I like that one. What was the one where it was like you you reached into my heart <laughs> I reached pulled in, out no reached into my chest pulled out my heart said and, happy birthday motherfucker and did something with it and then like shot it into space but I don't know <laughs> it's always crazy All right. it always has nothing to do with anything Jeff, but they're always like amazing I, I know I'm fucking shit we were really good like last episode it's cause now we're in back into season one mode um, even though we're in season two you know what, I've been doing four this because whole time. Because the first few episodes of the new season, they have to be like the old season or people won't watch. And so then it's like you gotta gradually introduce new things. Like, you know. Our first season sucked. Like, what if we did something different and we actually got, like... Good? Yeah, like amazing views and whatnot. Or what we if... We became the next Game Grumps. Or what if... Dude, no! <laughs> You're fired! Or what if we just, like, recast everybody <clears throat> from the get-go? Like, oh. What if, like, Glenn Close played David? I wouldn't watch it. I am Glenn Close. <laughs> <laughs> Remove mask on audio. I'm gonna be. Wait, no. Then I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be Steve Buscemi. Not Rob Schneider. <clears throat> nah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> <laughs> He's not good enough to be me. All right, let's do this. Let's actually get some shit done this episode. <laughs> nah, that'd be nice. Cause I'm trapped between world four or level I'm four and seven. Trapped between worlds. <laughs> It's a scary thought. That is a good what the Jesus fuck Christ even? <laughs> I'm doing it. <laughs> no, you're not. 
Uh, you, you can't chef. let it go too far down, or then you get you fall. Through I'm it. like pressing it instantly. No, you're I like right. went into that like this. Jeff, it's like having sex with a woman. You have to be gentle. What does she want? I'm not rough? familiar. Well, she wants it rough. I don't know. What does she want it rough? From, <laughs> what does she wants it rough from men with hairy bums. <laughs> hairy bums? Yeah. What does that have to do with anything? I don't know. She might really like hairy asses. You don't know that. <laughs> oh, I guess. Well, you did fucking judge, you piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> shit. I mean, she's like, fuck. I want a man who has a big hairy bum to stick it in me. <laughs> bum. And you're like, damn, babe, that's fucked up. And she's like, I don't even give a fuck about you. No! <laughs> do you do it twice? I got thrown back and I slid off the edge. Oh. That was great. Because I keep hitting, I keep missing the uh I'm about blue to fucking die off. for real. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I meant die for my last life, not <laughs> real in real life. Nope, that's it. It's all <laughs> I'm about to actually perish. Bye, Jeff. The Ooder's singing for me. Whoa. Oh, Danny boy. <laughs> That's so Could you imagine? <laughs> so cold. <laughs> Let me fucking ood sing Danny boy. I fucking... I didn't hear what you actually said, so I just ood. had to start singing something. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> ood will sing for you. Oh, Danny boy. <laughs> Fuck, I'd weep if some mood sang Danny boy for me. What was that song you two sang together when we went to the science center? It was uh, Beyond the Sea. Beyond right. <laughs> Somewhere... Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Be on the sea. <laughs> yes. Some oh, shit balls and burn my fucking for forehead. Me. That fire burns my cap and head. I got nothing. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I, got, I, like the, I got nothing else. <laughs> just say end of song. <laughs> <laughs> Instead of just letting it end, he has to state the song is ending now. I'm out of words. So, this is why I don't write music professionally. Or in any capacity. Yeah, exactly. Like... I'm not good at most things. <laughs> That's for sure. I want that on a t-shirt with your face on it. I'm not good at most things. <laughs> <laughs> or just, I'm not good at most things. The David Joslin story. <laughs> I'd read it. Or watch it. Oh. <laughs> I like how it's still there. Fucking get wrecked. Yeah. Smushed. I'm trapped between those levels. I can't escape. <laughs> Scary. I can't. Yeah. Back to that. I, I was thinking of like getting stuck in space. Ah, uh, that would suck. Because, you know, you're all alone out there. Well, Locked. George Clooney's out there. George Clooney is Where he belongs. <laughs> Where he belongs. <laughs> that makes me think of like Obama as a snake man. <laughs> That's the craziest shit. <laughs> Because Michael was talking about space, it reminded me I read something on Clickhole recently, um, and it was about like um, <laughs> it's about astronauts like experiences with space. Clickhole. I never knew <laughs> one like say it out loud. And um, <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say it's very strange. It is. And um, one of the astronauts and like because Clickhole is like one of those clickbait websites, like everything's fake on it. Yeah. One of the um, you'll never believe what'll happen to this fucker's yeah. nephew, and you're like, I I probably will. <laughs> He's probably and, um, not even real. <laughs> it was an astronaut's accounting of accounting of space, and he was just like, the the most terrifying thing about space is when uh, you hear an, everyone on the ship is accounted for, and you hear a knock outside, and on the intercom they're saying, "It's me, Ramirez. Let me in." But Ramirez is sitting right beside you. <laughs> <laughs> and you tell the person outside that, and they start banging on the door saying, Let me in, I'm really Ramirez! And Ramirez is right beside you telling you not to let him in. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's the most confusing, weird shit. It's like an adult swim short or something. Like, yeah, pretty much. Waiting to happen. It was the only interesting one, so I read it. It's a scary thought. It is a scary thought. It reminded me of the episode of read... Doctor Who Midnight. Oh, I love that one. It's like that thing, like, when it's like you hear your mom call you downstairs, so you start heading down, but then you hear your mom yell up above you, don't go downstairs. Which yeah. one do you trust? Oh, God. i never heard that before. That's really creepy. There's some really creepy shit on the internet. Like Slender Man. Or like that... Like, like the, then drowned. The oldest, um... The oldest, oh, yeah. shortest horror story ever, or whatever. Yeah. The Last Man on Earth. No. Was alone in the was alone in a room, and, her, and someone knocked on the door. Yeah. Fuck. That gives me chills even just just now thinking of that. Like it's so freaky. It is freaky. It's like aliens. Mm. Uh. I've recently. That's why that we talk started talking about this. Uh, next time I'll I'll go into more 
Spooky details. Ooh. A nice it's little, not spooky, uh, but, uh, Well, we'll finish this level first. Oh, well, then I... It'll maybe. be like three seconds. Just going to die right here. <laughs> no, have faith. I don't have faith in anything. Oh, right, I'll, I'll just say it. Okay, yeah. might as well. This will be a nice long one, maybe. So I've recently been, like, into this mood where I watch, like, crazy spooky shit. Yeah. Like, with aliens and, like, real, like, videos of aliens. Okay, well, quote-unquote real. Yeah. And, uh, and ghosts and shit. So much shit. I, like, watch it, like, 4 o'clock in the morning. Jesus. I'm just, like, awake and, like, I feel like the shit spooked out of me. And I'm like, oh, well, aliens are real. Ghosts are real. It's all over. What about the ghosts of aliens? I wonder if that's a thing. Alien ghosts? I mean, it would have to be, right? If, go, if ghosts maybe, exist. Well, maybe Do I go ghosts, up or across? Across. Maybe ghosts are like a, an earth thing. What the fuck? You always hit your head. You gotta wait. You, you gotta you like let go it rearrange, uh, reorientate I itself. didn't know if it was going to. Oh, well. Next time on Bomb Turnip. Bomb Turnip. <laughs> new <laughs> name, new season. Get used to it. Uh, 1995.